In this module, you will learn about crop protection management. What is crop protection management? Nurturing crop plants against damage from weeds, pests, and diseases is known as crop protection management. What are weeds? Weeds like xanthium, parthenium, and Cyperinus rotundus are unwanted plants in a crop field. They compete with the crop plants for food, space, and light, and thereby reduce crop growth. Weeds can be removed by spraying herbicides or by mechanically removing them. Timely sowing of crops, intercropping and crop rotation can also control weeds. Insects that damage crops are called pests. Generally, pests attack plants and reduce their yield. They cut the root, stem and leaves. Suck the cell sap and bore into the stem and fruits. Pests can be controlled by using pesticides. Diseases in plants are caused by pathogens such as bacteria, fungi and viruses just like in humans. These pathogens are transmitted through soil water and air. They can be controlled with pesticides which include insecticides, herbicides and fungicides. These can be sprayed on crop plants or can be used for treating seeds and soil. The use of resistant varieties and summer ploughing also destroy weeds and pests. After the crops have been harvested and the grains have been stored, they need protection during storage as well. What factors may be responsible for the loss of grains during storage? Storage losses in grains are due to biotic factors like insects, rodents, fungi, mites and bacteria. Abiotic factors like inappropriate moisture and temperatures in the storage place also damage grains. These factors lead to loss in weight, poor germinability and discoloration of the grains, which lead to poor marketability. Grains should be cleaned and properly dried, first in sunlight and then in the shade before storage. Exposure to chemical fumes helps kill pests. This process is called fumigation. These steps reduce 